welcome. We have Josh Bayless from the Foss Camden Football Club. He's our Division 2 uh, weekly roundup. How are you, all right, Josh? Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. Um, just going through the weekend's results in Division 2. Um, in the first game, which was not yours, uh, Sacred Heart, 9-12-66, uh, defeated Gazer 9-10-64. So, uh, two-point yeah. victory to um, Sacred Heart, where you used to go to school. Tell us a little bit about that game you know of. Oh, do that. Shocking result, really. I think I think they got up by a point just by after the siren, ten point. Or they were, two points. Yeah, yeah, two points was it? Yeah, yeah. there you go. Um, they kicked the goal right, right either before or after the siren and got them over the line. Does the job, doesn't it? Okay. Yeah. And throughout the year, you would have come up against both clubs. How did you fare with both? Well, Sacred Heart's always been a bit of a rivalry between us and them. Um, oh. We beat them our first first game we played them. Yep. Um, pretty convincingly at home. Yes. And then we played them out at uh, Thimpton Oval, which is quite a quite a large oval, and they played that very well under the wet wet conditions. And yeah, they got over us in the end, which was pretty disappointing. Hmm. And um, this week, uh, sorry, uh, last week also the uh, the game where you played in. It was Athelston, uh, nine goals, seven sixty-one, defeated Foss Camden, six eight forty-four out of Athelston. Mm. How did that play out? Yeah, they're, Athelston's a pretty well-drilled side with their with their defence, and we just couldn't manage to be accurate enough to chip through their defence and get away with our, playing our style of footy, which which really hurt us in the end. You led early. Yeah, yeah. Um, we got away to a good start. Uh, I think three or four goals ahead in yep. the first first quarter, which was very very good for us because we're usually a slow starting team, which is which isn't the best. Um, but then we dropped off, our skills dropped off, and then the, the result the results show that. Yeah, um, half time you were up or behind? Um, I think it was pretty even. I think we might have just been behind. By a goal or two, but um, they just slightly kicked away in the last half. There, did they? Yeah, they just chipped away at us, which wasn't wasn't the best. Yeah, this week, obviously, again, you've got to Sacred Heart in the prelim final. Do you know a, uh, where you're going to be playing yet? I know it's. I heard it wasn't at Foss. Do you know where the game is? Oh, I heard it was at Foss. Okay, it might well I be. I think yeah. we're hosting them. Okay, so oh, so that should be pretty good. We're always we're always a good home team to play at and. We're pretty confident going into the game. So, yeah. yeah, where's the strengths and weaknesses you think for Sacred Heart? I think that fitness isn't isn't where it should be at the moment, but um, we're not relying on any anything they're doing. We're just going to do our do our own thing and. Where's, where's your strengths at, at, at Foss? Definitely a running game. We're more of a small small team, so we like to run as much as we can through. Break, them, break the lines. Okay, so you, um, lots of foot passing and um, handball hitting up targets and uh, yeah, sure. running the ball through the lines. Yeah. Oh, well, thank you for doing the weekly roundup and good luck this week. Yeah, cheers.